is the newest uh, boutique location for Mayor. It's called Maker Boutique. And I explained what I'm doing here in the last video. But um, anyway, I am just here thinking about what happened yesterday. So yesterday was actually a really eventful day. It was a 12 hour work day where I, um, you know, co worked with another designer here in Houston named Beth Perpich. And she is a handbag designer also in the great city of Houston. And we together are also sold in the Four Seasons Hotel. And I had, I mean, the whole day was queued up very well. It was a great vlog, but I'm not gonna show you any of it because the end of the day, um, something really interesting happened. And I've been going back and forth and back and forth for the last, oh, I don't know, 12 hours. Like, should I show this? Should I not? Should, you know, should, th that is not what my vlog is about, but I feel like having the colorism talk and having the race talk is important for everyone, whether you're black, white, Asian, or Hispanic, and every other race, I think we should all talk about it. So um, I am just gonna cut to me explaining, Beth and I explaining, <laughs> Beth and I explaining what happened, and leave your comments. Let us know what you think. Let's start that conversation. Um, so, yeah, enjoy. I'm here with Beth. Suits up. Hi. Yes, Beth and I have had meetings here. We're at the Four Seasons Hotel. Uh, we've had meetings here the whole day. We've been here the whole day. We've had multiple meetings the whole day. Uh, it is midnight, so it's, it's tomorrow. <laughs> tomorrow. And we have had the most awkward celebrity encounter. Yeah. Uh, I don't even have words for what happened. Like I'm still speechless. I'm still trying to c c yeah, comprehend <laughs> what what just happened. <laughs> and it's not funny. Um, yeah. It it happened to Beth, but it happened when I was sitting right here. And so I'm just gonna hand over the camera and let her tell you the story. Oh, thank you. This thing is cool. So, Mayor and I are sitting here. Um, just enjoying the day. Enjoying the day. We've been having meetings all day. Uh, sitting here at the Four Seasons, which is a very nice establishment, okay? And we, Mayor spots a man that's walking by and she's like, oh my God, that's Matthew Knowles. Mm -hmm. That's Beyonce's dad. Mm -hmm. And I thought, oh my God, this is crazy. So anyway, we stop, he stops to talk to us. Um, we were talking, Mayor was making nice, making her manners, saying, you know, things that were polite and, you know, genuine. And not racial. <laughs> not, not racial. Not racial. And then I, it was my turn to speak, and so I said, oh, well, Mayor is a fragrance designer, mm -hmm. I am a handbag designer, and we're both sold in the Four Seasons here at the hotel. Which and is where we're at. This is where we're at right now. Right. We've been here the Four Seasons because we sell here and we've been having meetings here all day. So, yeah. anyway, we I share this information with this man and um, I was so excited because I'm, you know, I'm excited because I had just written down, Mary and I had been going back and forth writing down our goals for 2018 and writing it down makes it come true. And so we... I would write a goal, then Mayor would write a goal. And then I'd write a goal, then Mayor would write a goal. Well, when Mayor went to the bathroom, I wrote another goal. And my goal said, I want Beyonce to carry my bag. Did not know that her father was here. Okay, so this is before. So, the, I mean, I was thinking the timing of this is perfect. So. I'm so excited, I pick up my notebook and I show her father, I said, look, I just wrote down this goal about your daughter. I mean, I am so excited. I want your daughter to carry my bag. And he said, that'll never happen. 
That's never gonna happen. She'll never carry your bag. And I was crushed. I thought, oh my God, like, he's either seen my designs or he knows that I'm not a Gucci or a Louis Vuitton or whatever. And she's beyond that. Like, I'm too small time for her. Um, I'm not good enough, is what I, I thought he was saying, she'll never carry your bag. Like, you're not good enough. Instead, what he was meaning was she'll never carry your bag in a racial way. Like, Mary, you may have to. He said that she would never carry your bag for you. Like, she, yeah. he thought, he misunderstood and thought that Beth meant, I want Beyonce to carry my bag in a slave mentality kind of way. Like, I want to be walking and I want Beyonce to be carrying the bags for me. Like, I get off a plane and there's Beyonce carrying my bags for me. That is not what she meant. Uh, no, not at all. Not at all. Um, and so, it took me a second to realize, and also for Mayor to realize, that he interpreted this this way. I just thought, I, you know, he was putting my designs down. I mean, he took it as me being a racist. a racist. It's not racist, by the way. Yeah, I could tell you that I'm not racist. He said, well, this is a teachable moment. I'm going to use this in my class. He teaches at Texas Southern University here in Houston. And he said he was going to tell his entire class about me and my racism. We just we just kind of wanted to do this. I'm a vlogger. I happen to be a vlogger. We just wanted and to explain. An amazing uh, fragrance designer. Perfumer, yes. Perfumer. Just wanted to explain that not everything said to someone of the opposite race is racial. You didn't mean that as a racial, Absolutely to be not. derogatory. I was looking as if uh, she would bless me by wearing one of my handbags yeah. and uh, repping one of my bags that would, you know, she would enjoy or um, find some use for uh, and, you know, support a local female Houstonian. I mean, the bottom line is I think we all are trying to be kind to one another and especially me in my life, I'm trying to be kind to other people and for me to not get that reciprocated uh, is is it's just, rough. Is rough. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's rough. But again, we just want to say this is no, we are not trying to shade Beyonce. No, oh my god. Or we no. are not trying to shade Matthew Knowles. We're just we're just letting you know what happened. We're sharing a story. Yes. So yeah, that's all. That's all we're saying. Um. So yeah, let us know what you think about yeah. what just happened in the in the comments. Yeah. So we'll be reading. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs>